Windows Copilot is a new AI assistant for Windows 11. It has chat-based UI where you can ask your queries and get an answer from the chatbot. Also, it can change various settings in the operating system with a simple command. For example, if you want to switch to dark mode, you can just give it a command like enable dark mode and it will do the task for you. And you won't have to dig into the settings to do it yourself. Once launched, the Windows Copilot sidebar stays on the right side of the display and it doesn't overlap with your other open apps and programs. It seamlessly runs alongside other app windows, allowing you to interact with Copilot effortlessly whenever you require its assistance. Windows Copilot is now up for testing in the Dave channel of Windows Insider program. However, it is not available for all Windows Insiders just yet. But if you are eager to try it out, I'll show you how to enable it using a third-party tool. If you want to try out Windows Copilot, you'll need to be running Windows 11 build 23493 or a newer version. It's currently only available in the Windows Insider Dave channel. First of all, if you're not already on the Dave channel, you have to enroll your Windows 11 PC into this channel. To do so, open the Windows 11 settings app. Go to Windows Update. From here, you can choose Windows Insider Program. Then link your Microsoft account. You need to choose Dave channel. After that, restart your PC. After reboot, you can go back to Windows Update. And click the Check for Updates button. Your PC will download and install Windows 11 Build 23493 or newer version. After downloading the latest Windows 11 Build, restart your PC to install it. Once you are up and running the latest Windows 11, you can follow the next steps to enable Windows Copilot on your PC. Open this GitHub page and download the latest release of Vive Tool GUI. After downloading, launch the installer and complete the installation. Once the app is installed, open it. Here in the build section, you have to select your Windows 11 build. You can quickly check it in the about section of the system settings. Wait a few minutes to allow the list to populate. Next, click on manually change a feature. We need to activate some hidden features which are needed for running Windows Copilot. We'll activate those features using their IDs. I'll put all the IDs in the video description. You just need to copy each ID one by one. Paste it here, then click the Perform Action button and choose Activate Feature. Do the same for each ID. Lastly, you must ensure your PC has Microsoft Edge version 115 or higher. If not, you can update the browser from this page. Okay, everything is done. Now restart your PC. After the restart, you'll see the new Windows Copilot icon on your taskbar. Click on it to open the AI chatbot. You can also press the Windows plus C button to access the Copilot. After opening Copilot, you can go ahead and use it for fun. You can just chat with it just like you do with Bing AI or ChatGPT. 
Choose the conversation type, balanced, creative or precise. Precise will give you the most accurate answers. It brings the Bing powered chat, so you can ask anything and it will answer all of your queries. You can ask follow-up questions to continue the conversation. You can also ask Copilot to summarize website contents from the Microsoft Edge browser. When you are on a web page, click on this Bing chat button and it opens Windows Copilot. You can then ask Copilot to summarize the website you are viewing. It can also generate basic AI images. Let's ask Copilot to make a picture of a dog playing with kids. You can also ask Copilot to perform basic tasks on your PC. For example, if I ask it to take a screenshot, Copilot will invoke the snipping tool and capture the screen. All I have to do is click the mouse to save the image. If I tell it to enable do not disturb, it displays an option to toggle the settings. This is just the beginning of Copilot and for now it can only perform a few tasks. This will only improve over time since Copilot is a work in progress. If other people use your PC, you may want to reset the Copilot chat. To do so, click on the three dots and select refresh. Now my whole conversation is reset from the chat. So guys, this is how you can enable and use Windows Copilot AI on Windows 11 PC. The new Copilot AI of Windows 11 will only become more advanced with time and will be very beneficial, especially if you are a fan of AI tools. What's your take on the new Windows Copilot AI? Let us know in the comments below.